Hey, how's it going, everyone, and welcome back to another reaction video. So, in my last reaction video, I did well, two reactions, I should say. One, two. Well, I did a reaction video on the two World of Warcraft trailers. One for being Cataclysm Classic, and the other for being the new expansion that's coming out sometime next year, World of Warcraft, The War Within. Now, I do apologize that my voice seems a little muffled. As you can tell, I'm wearing my fucking skull mask because I want to. Now, for those of you who want to comment down in the comment box, like, oh, just do a fucking face reveal. Screw the, screw the skull mask. Yeah, no thanks. I want to keep the skull mask on because I like being anonymous and you fuckers can't tell what I look like. Well, except for my TikTok where I wear just a half mask. Anyways. So, funny enough. I saw a trailer for apparently a new Ghostbusters movie. They're coming out in 2024 called Ghostbusters Frozen Empire. I shit you guys not. I saw this trailer, um, and, I'm, and I'm thinking to myself, oh, for the love of God, they're coming out with another Ghostbusters movie. Holy hell. I mean, when did Ghostbusters Afterlife even come out? Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. Afterlife 2021, so it's been roughly two years since Afterlife came out. And now they're doing Frozen Empire for 2024. I'm sorry, but holy hell, they need to stop with the Ghostbusters movie. They need to stop with the ghost they need to stop with the Ghostbusters movies. Holy shit. In fact, they need to stop with the whole fucking franchise. I mean, seriously. I think they've milked it quite enough. And I think on top of that, they don't need to add in any more new cast to keep the franchise alive. We already had God knows how many Ghostbusters movies, including the one from 2018 and a fucking game based off of that one. Seriously, uh, Ghostbusters were taking place in New York again. This time with an, with an all-female cast. Actually, no. All I know is that they made a game off of one of the Ghostbusters movies. I forget what the game was called, though, but they definitely made a, a game based off of one of the movies, or at least they made a Ghostbusters game. Like, I'm sorry, but... They're seriously milking their franchise at this point, squeezing every drop, squeezing every bitty little drop from the Ghostbusters franchise sponge. They're squeezing that sucker dry. The fact that it's coming out with another fucking movie. Holy shit. They really need to stop. Just like how sometime in the past. <sighs> I think it was like around two years ago, maybe three. Hollywood announced that they were going to make another Terminators movie. That's a direct sequel to Judgment Day. I'm thinking, okay, again, just end the Terminator franchise. I mean, we've had all these fucking, all these different Terminator movies spanning across different timeline different timelines we've had terminator terminator 2 3 judgment day salvation genesis dark fate and now hollywood wants to make another terminator terminator movie based solely on like it does a direct sequel to judgment day oh this Hollywood's gonna kill me with this. I mean, seriously. 
They're seriously squeezing that franchise sponge dry. All liquid money they can squeeze out of them suckers. Between Terminator and Ghostbusters. Holy shit, are they milking that, these franchises fucking dry. And now... The Five Nights at Freddy's movie has officially come out. It came out last Friday the 3rd. And I've yet to see it because I want to see it with a friend of mine who was unable to see it because of family issues. So I'm going to see if I can maybe see it with her sometime next week because I really want to see the Five Nights at Freddy's movie. I really want to see it. It looks so fucking cool. So yeah. Anywho, of my little Peter Panning ranter, let us watch the official teaser trailer for Ghostbusters Frozen Empire. Now, like I said, I saw the trailer last night, and I'm just astonished they're making another fucking Ghostbusters movie. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Well, if you folks want to, if you folks want to give yourself some refreshments, go for it. Otherwise. Kick back, relax, and let us watch Ghostbusters A Frozen Empire. There are Dell Edge devices that will scale up conservation at a level that have never been seen before. Alright, uh, scary zombie transformation in the movie. Not interested. Alright. Alright. I'm telling you, it's going to be another hot one out there. In fact, there are heat alerts in effect for New Jersey, feeling like 100 degrees. First time in New York history, people froze to death in the middle of July. What is it? The death chill. The power to kill by fear itself. Your veins turn to rivers of ice. Your bones crack. And the last thing you see is your own tear ducts freezing up. Like, literally scared to death? So cool. <laughs> I gotta say, one, this, this. This right here, all of this, this would make for a perfect ass screenshot for a computer background. No, I'm not even joking. This would make a perfect computer background screenshot. Anywho, but yeah, that is Ghostbusters, the Frozen. For the Frozen Empire. I guess it's the ghost right here. <laughs> you know, I'm actually surprised this guy is happy to be a Ghostbuster considering in Afterlife he was scared shitless of ghosts whatsoever. Sorry, I'm getting some notifications on Discord. But, yeah, I remember in, after, in Afterlife, in Ghostbusters Afterlife, this guy right here who plays Scott Lang in the MCU, he was scared shitless of ghosts in the last movie. All of a sudden, he's like fucking 
stoked to become a Ghostbuster? Like, what the hell? Anyways, but, yeah. Just, like I said, they really, really need to end the Ghostbusters franchise already. I mean, holy hell. We don't need any more Ghostbusters movie, guys. Focus in Hollywood. We, we don't need any more Ghostbusters movies. We really don't. Oh, the boys are showing Marvel forever. I don't really care. Oh, that's right. They're also making a RoboCop Rogue City game. I'm just curious. Has there been... Has there ever been a game based off of RoboCop? I don't think there ever has. As I know, there's like the 1960s... The, the 1990s movie RoboCop. And then the modern day version. I don't think there's ever been a RoboCop game before. As far as I know. Yeah, as far as I know, there haven't been, there's no RoboCop game, so this should be interesting to say at least. But yeah. Well, folks, I do hope you enjoyed this reaction video. As I did today, I do apologize if my, if my voice sounds a bit muffled. I am wearing this very tight skull face mask. Hopefully sometime in the near future what I plan to do is just cut off this entire section of the face mask where the this white skull jawline is just cut all this off and use my half skull mask which is sitting on my desk and maybe just maybe sew the half mask to this that way I can speak clearly and breathe properly because this heavy this heavy fabric is making it very tough to breathe through it really is so yeah Anywho, like I, like I did state, I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you folks want to leave a form of feedback in the form of a comment, like, dislike, subscription, share, you all know the drill. So, yeah, nothing else to say. I bid you all a farewell.